In this video, we are going to review the best mountain bike helmet available in the current market. After reviewing many users we built this best list for you. So let's get started. Number 1. Gyro Chronicle MIPS. Gyro's Chronicle is designed to be a mid-range offering, but it ended up outperforming many of its much more expensive counterparts in our test. The competition was tight, but at less than half the price of some of the heavy hitters, the Chronicle is an excellent value with no glaring weak points. Our favorite aspect of this model was its versatile fit. Gyro has decades of expertise and offers a calculated fit for the majority of head shapes. On top of that, the Chronicle sits low on the head for a secure feeling, high coverage fit, and the rock lock harness system pulls even tension around the whole head. With MIPS integrated into its interior, the Chronicle also provides modern protection and peace of mind out on the trail. Number 2. Laser Sport Kyra MIPS. The Ambush Helmet, $200, weighs in at 309 GS and has 20 vents, but what sets it apart is the high tech connectivity. The Ambush has a patented helmet mounted ANGI, angular, and G force indicator, crash sensor. If a crash is detected, the device sends SMS and email notifications to specific contacts via the specialized Ride app on iOS or Android. When the sensor detects a crash, it sends a countdown alert to the rider's phone that they can deactivate in up to 90 seconds. Otherwise, it will notify emergency contacts via SMS and email. The sensor also syncs with Strava and the specialized Ride app to provide GPS-based activity tracking which can be sent to the rider's emergency contacts as well. We did not test this helmet on jumps and did not experience an emergency crash, but found the system works on trail rides. Number 3. POC Cordal Race MIPS The Cordal Race is constructed with what POC calls a unibody shell, meaning the helmet is molded as one single unit for better strength. It also features aramid bridges, which reinforce the strength of the helmet and enhance overall durability. The Cordal Race has the best coverage of any of the helmets we tested, with the shell coming down close to the ears and over the bottom of the back of the skull. For rotational impact protection, POC uses the new MIPS Integra in this helmet. Unlike traditional MIPS, where a thin plastic lining sits inside the helmet shell to allow for a small amount of rotational movement, MIPS Integra takes the same idea and integrates it into the padding in the helmet. This technology makes for a rotational impact protection system in the helmet that is equally effective, but more comfortable and less noticeable than the original MIPS design. Number 4. Gyro Tyrant MIPS. As part of a new wave of moto-inspired, open-face trail helmets, the Gyro Tyrant provides significantly more head coverage than most of the standard mountain bike helmets we tested. Gyro builds this beefy lid as a versatile option that can span the gap between gravity, trail, and dirt jump helmets. After weeks of rigorous testing, we support Gyro's claim that it's an incredibly versatile helmet despite its heavy, protective construction. The first thing you'll notice when donning the Tyrant is that it shares a unique dual-shell construction with its half-shell counterpart, the Manifest. The inner shell is low-density EPP foam for minor impacts, and the outer shell is high-density EPS to absorb major collisions. Despite its double-shell composition, the helmet keeps a relatively low profile on your head, and the vents do a surprisingly good job of keeping things cool. Combine the innovative protection and coverage with Gyro's Rock Lock Harness System and refined shell shape, and you have a helmet that stays comfortable all day. Number 5. Bell Sixer MIPS Bell Sixer is basically the little brother to the Bell Super with the difference mainly that is not a full-face helmet. I like that the liner has silver fibers that inhibits the growth of bacteria so it doesn't get stinky. It's one of the heavier helmets out there, but that's due to the extra polystyrene foam inside the helmet, it's definitely thicker than many other helmets. I would assume it gives you an extra measure of protection, because of it plus it has MIPS protection, spending a lot of time in FL, ventilation is important to me. The Sixer has 20 large vents that provide excellent airflow. The visor has four positions for adjustment, or you can remove it completely by just unsnapping it. 
The breakaway helmet mount is perfect for recording your rides and jumps. The helmet is very durable with a polycarbonate shell that can take lots of use, which being a mountain bike helmet it inevitably will. The Sixer comes down far over the back of your head offering full coverage and protection. Overall the Sixer is an excellent helmet at a reasonable price. Thanks for watching this video. Hope you like this unbiased review. And please don't forget to subscribe us to get the news of upcoming reviews. Stay tuned.